Good afternoon, my name is Matthew from Axel and today I'm making a short video to demonstrate and show the configuration of a Topaz signature pad reader attached to an Axel terminal. So first I'll just show it working. What we have here is an Axel Model 80, the signature pad and connected to a Windows 2008 server and if I scribble on the stylus here is the signature. So the configuration is very straightforward. I'll run through from factory defaults. So there's the basic configuration. The specific part for the signature pad, enter setup, control, alt escape, go into ports, USB logical ports, USB 1, it's detected the device. We can see here the UART on the signature pad. So it's simply a matter of going down here and enabling the RDP ICA redirection. Set that to a COM port and in the COM port parameters by default, the SIGPAD uses COM9. Uh, I'm sure we could change it in the Topaz software to use a, a different COM, but I'll set that to COM9 to match the default. Save everything. Quit out. Reconnect to our terminal server. And I'll fire up the Topaz software. Click on start and do a scribble and it's working as expected. Now I'll just show a couple of diagnostic things that you can look at if all doesn't go as expected. So if you enter setup, control or escape, go into diagnostics USB, then you should see the device listed along with any other USB devices you have attached. And the things to look for is check that the interface is COM and the driver being used is USB COM. That confirms that the terminal has recognized the device as a USB device with an embedded USB to serial converter. The other thing to check is when you're connected, press Control, Alt, Shift, I, and that pops up a window which describes all the parameters for the actual RDP or ICA connection. And within here you'll see redirected COM port and it confirms it's COM9 uh, on USB 1. Just one final point to make, this signature pad does have a USB connector on it, but it, in terms of the thin client, it's seen as a serial device with an embedded serial to USB converter in it. So I hope that all makes sense. If you have any questions, please contact Axel. Our details will follow. Thank you very much and bye for now.